Premier Comrade Mielakov, Comrade Agents, thank you for coming. Here's what we know so far. Ten years ago, the United States government covered up an invasion by an alien race known as Furons. The primary agent was this Furon, Cryptosporidium 137. Dangerous, unpredictable, and now, deceased. So, what has been problem? The problem, Conrad, is that Furons can clone themselves and pose convincingly as human. And they've used these abilities to put Cryptosporidium 138 into the White House. Then the American people are not noticing? Uh. <laughs> ah, right. Pull the other one. Even worse, this new Crypto clone contains pure Furon DNA harvested from human brains by Orthopox 13, mastermind of the invasion. He also bears a mysterious new mutation, referred to only as the package. Ooh. These aliens pose a dire threat to the Soviet Union, comrades. And so, must be destroyed. <laughs> President Crypto is in Bay City, attending a new cultural festival. And Orthopox? Conducting experiments in the Furon Mothership. Savages. Generates. There's only one way to deal with such men. Revolution. Can't be good. <laughs> Greetings, comrade. Mother Russia sends her regards. You expect me to beg, human? No, little Furon. I expect you to die. Mine's free.
Things are not looking good. Virtual pox, huh? Kinda constricting, ain't it? Well, beggars can't be choosers. I need to bring in some big guns. Uh, know where I can get my hands on some. I did manage to jettison some data cores before the mothership was hit. You might be able to recover some weapons from them if you can find any, but it certainly won't be easy. Okay, so... Where are the data cores? That's just it! They could have entered the atmosphere at any time, in any place, and therefore landed anywhere on the planet. I've managed to locate only one. It was ejected after my holopox unit, so it landed quite nearby. I didn't bring any with me. Figured, uh, heavy artillery ain't exactly the smoothest way to charm the jeans off a pacifist hippie chick. Oh, I knew it! I knew your unnatural interest in humans would bring us nothing but trouble! Whoa, 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 you're harsh in my buzz. Mellow out, Poxy. Easy for you to say. You weren't blown to pieces just seconds before restoring your own genitalia! Well, I guess there's nothing left to do but scout the area and find that data core.
I don't understand it. We blew that alien spacecraft out of the sky, and yet the shriveled geriatric one somehow survived. These Jopas must be harder to kill than we thought. I spit on them! <laughs> Nonetheless, inform the Kremlin we shall proceed with the operation as planned. Tell them we need as much revelade as they can ship, as quickly as they can ship it. Da, Agent Orinchov. And our American distributor? He suspects nothing. In fact, he seemed quite enthusiastic about the whole idea. He thinks he'll be spreading revolution in a paper cup. And so he will. 
but not, I think, the sort he expects. Idealists. They spit on them! Pleh! Stalin, he understood. Ideas may start revolutions, but guns and gulags finish them. Well, no matter. Soon the citizens of Bay City will be embarking on a very bad trip. <laughs> Still spinning. What the hell's going on around here? Why are those Ruskies gunning for us? Frankly, I'm more concerned with how the KGB managed such a successful twin strike. They're not usually so organized. We need to find them, Crypto, before they spring any more surprises. I should have known. The drugs, the alcohol, the loose chicks, the signs, they were all there. It's obvious those hippies were trying to lure me in, so I'd let my guard down. Nice try, hippies. But I'm not just any mindless hedonist. I'm the best! Don't worry, Pox. I've got this covered. I'll wipe out every one of those bastards for what they did to my guns, and you. Slow down, Crypto. I doubt hippies had much to do with ambushing you and destroying the mothership. Oh, damn. On the other hand, their brains don't provide much usable DNA anyway. So knock yourself out, if you're so inclined. Okay, so what? I just start knocking on doors and doing the slicing dice? You do not! The KGB are hardly likely to hang around if you just start indiscriminately blowing away humans. Yeah, well, I was just brainstorming. Well, stop! I've done a little research in the criminal files of the local constabulary. Apparently, there's one informant in Bay City who always knows what's going down on the streets. They call him the Freak. The Freak, huh? Yeah, I I've heard about him. Cat's got connections all over town. He's kind of a burnout, though. From what I hear, he doesn't even need drugs anymore. He lives in his own personal mental lava lamp. But if any of those stinky monkeys knows what the KGB are up to, I bet he does. And I suggest you locate him and find out what he knows. All right, enough chit-chat. I'm off to find her little hippie friend, the Freak.
kosher. You want to see police brutality? We got him. 10-4. All units stand down. Wait a minute, you're not Richard Nixon. You mind? This is hard enough as it is. Guess I picked the wrong day to go off my meds. Just the guns you talk. I can't get away from me. Something exciting might happen. No girl with action. Maybe I'll ask the freak for I hear there's a guy called the freak down at the If I see that freak down at the park, I'm gonna make him cut his hair and get a real job. Hey, that'd make a great country song. Frequent. Probably up on the hill doing his mountaintop hermit routine. Weirdo. I am king of the lizards. <laughs> Hey there, uh, Moon Doggy. Uh, I'm looking for a dude with his ear to the street. The kids call him the Freak. You found him, but I'm all tapped out, man. The heat's coming down on me, you know. Try me next week. Freak, in all your drug-induced visions, I'm sure you've gained much, uh, wisdom. Hey, I'm just 
trying to find me, Camino man. No different from you. But I've fried my share of brain cells, that's for sure. Super. Which is why I seek your, uh, well, for lack of a better word, let's uh, call it guidance. Right on, Seeker! What can I do you for? Uh, got any tips for dealing with the ladies? Patience, love, mutual respect. Those are the ways to earn a woman's heart. Are you serious? You sound like Gloria freaking Steinem. Whoa, now, I'm a liberated man. What's with the heavy vibe, mama? What? Oh, oh, crap, I forgot I'm a chick. Let's say, for the sake of argument, that I cannot clone myself. How do I live a long and healthy life? Sex, sex, and more sex! And if you can't be with the one you love, honey, love the one you're with! Wow, you really are wise. You're boring the love beads off of me here. Let, let, let's talk about something else. Well, what I need is information. What do you know about the Ivans in the cheap suits who crashed our party? You mean those KGB cats? Yeah, those dudes are straight, all right. They make Jack Lord look like Abby Hoffman. Only they didn't crash, man. They were invited. Who invited the KGB to uh, harsh our buzz? From what I hear, it was that cat who leads the commune. I don't know his real name, but he calls himself Coyote Bongwater. Which is pretty righteous. Supposedly, he's like this master of tantric meditation and spiritual healing. All I know is cat's got the chicks eaten out of his hookah. Okay, you've piqued my interest. Where do I find Coyote Bong Water? Well, from what I hear, he's kind of paranoid. He doesn't hang out at the park for long. I heard he's got a pad someplace, but I don't know where. What I do know is he's cutting into my livelihood. Dude's been handing out this new turn on a drink like in a, in a can. He calls it Revelade. Ain't that a bitch? If you want him, that's your in. Find some Revelade and you'll probably find Coyote Bong Water. What's in this Revelade stuff? He claims it's like an all natural elixir that enhances your cosmic awareness or something. Bong Water says it's the first shot in the global revolution against the man. Great. Great. Like, the monkeys aren't revolting enough already. Thanks, freak. I gotta go find Coyote Bongwater. I can't believe I just said that. In 10 years, I'm going to start a computer company in San Jose and own your asses. Arcudo has shown me that anger is nothing but a mind trap, man.
Asher's never going to leave his wife. Good thing I'm doing her, too. If this bong water guy thinks he can buy my loyalty by handing out free samples of his homebrewed mind-altering substance on Ashbury Street, then he's right! It's all about the buzz, man! And next week, we'll start one-on-one -on -one Shakti tutoring. I'll be giving each of you private, hands-on instruction in Kriyanish Pati, the highest state of tantric arousal. These sessions can run ten hours. So eat a good breakfast. That's it for today. Remember, wherever you go, I'll be there. The shine in your Japan, the sparkle in your China. Bodhisattva, Bodhisattva. Ah! Goddamn flashbacks. Guess again, sunshine. Nice little setup. Guns, cheap Russian booze, teenage bra burning hippie chicks. Man after my own heart, if I had one. Then join us! We're about to free the people of this city. Soon they'll see the truth and embrace our beautiful new utopia. The Bay City Super Organic Communal Collective and Compost Farm. Are you with us, man? Am I with you? Dude, you're bogarting the brain stems. I'm gonna have to kill you. Yeah, yeah. Kill me? Run along, comrade. My men can handle this. Pacifists. What a crook. Perimeter breached. Get bong water out of here. Hurry! Bomb water is being in danger. Get him out of here now. How's it hanging, freak? Uh, listen, I need a little more info. All right, but hurry it up, will ya? You're making me nervous. Here's the thing. I found Bong Water, but he got away before I could ice him. Whoa. I don't know, man. You didn't tell me you were going to get violent. You didn't ask. Smart hippie. Okay, okay. Maybe I've heard some things. He's gone underground and come up with a new plan to distribute his revelade. Hmm. 
prayed. What's that wacko up to now? Get this, somehow he got his hands on a whole bunch of blimps! Blimps? What's he gonna do? Start a tire company? It's not what's on the outside, man! It's what's on the inside! Gas! He's gonna gas the whole city with Revelade! Wow, that's so wild it might just work. Well, I'll tell you this, Bongwater's been drinking his own Revelade if he thinks his scheme's gonna work. Whatever. Hey, you coming to Jade's party? What? No, I'm gonna blow up Bongwater's blimps full of Revelade, didn't you hear me? Easy, man, move out! What am I doing talking to this creep? Fox, we got a situation here. Bongwater must be drinking his own product. The freak says he's planning to fumigate Bay City with giant blimps full of Revelade gas. Great galaxies! That's so moronic, it just might work. So let's get flying, huh? I'm itching for some serious payback. Not so fast, my ultraviolet minion. My scan of the engine core has revealed some critical damage. Ah, oh, crap. The good news is ancient Furon landing beacons were left here eons ago during the war with the Martians. If you can find and activate one of those beacons, you'll be able to summon your saucer. Neat trick. And then, I kick a little monkey ass. Furon God, zap my idol with bolts of electricity. Attend the holy syllables of the great Ark Voodoo. No sweat. It needs to be aired out every 5,000 parsecs or so. It appears the saucer took a hit. Or 12. On the way here. No, no, no. Don't say it. I'm afraid we can't possibly take off until the engine is repaired. Ah, man. Luckily, I've detected more data calls from the mothership nearby. Containing repair parts you can use to get the saucer up in flight. Once you're in the air, you can blow up blimps to your heart. Gotcha. I'll snatch up those repair pods and swing back to the saucer. Oh, That's yeah. not your property. It's payback. Houston, Joe. 
just call. You want your space suit back, Green? Punk! Yeah. Right on! Time to boogie! Your 
position. Oh, I can't watch. Thank God, Poodle, I have no eyes. Jerry, oh, I'm tripping. Okay, no more tripping. Ooh. Ah! Shh. It's the gear. Make little green heart.
Just tell me where Bong Water is so I can whack him and get back to making hot monkey love. When you're packing a new Ferrari, you don't want it gathering dust in the garage, you know what I'm saying? Not really. And Bong Water? What can I say, man? Nobody's seen the dude. Well, nobody's at Prudence, I guess. Who's Prudence? Uh, his insurance broker? Ah, dear Prudence. No, she's Bongwater's new protege. Kind of a revolutionista in training. <laughs> Anybody knows where Bongwater's at? It'd be Prudence. He sounds like a real firecracker. Maybe I should introduce myself. All right. I'm off to introduce myself to Prudence, see if I can convince her to give up bong water. Our commune at the park just got a lot foxier now that Prudence is there. Like a figurative class of form of goodness. There's more no than that meets the eye. This revelation is good. It's an attack! Take out those trucks immediately! Yeah. I ain't never been.
been this high. Always has an unsworn I heard bomb water. A good villain always has an unsworn I heard bomb water checking in the underpass under the hill. I gotta lay off the cheese puffs. <laughs> What's that? Okay, hey, hey, everybody run! Nobody take the yellow one! Is this thing on?
is crypto. Take out that psychedelic sociopath and save the hippies of base city for our experiment. I know. Now's my chance to nail that sleazy weasel once and for all. Agent Orangeoff, come in. Uh, I failed. You'll have to start the revolution without me. Yet. Yet? B but. The city is useless to us now. I mean, have you seen these people? They make the students in Prague look like a meeting of the Politburo. We shall destroy this degenerate city and return to the Soviet Union with the spacecraft fragments we have managed to retrieve. But what about freeing America from the tyranny of capitalist consumerism? Do not despair, comrade. The party will long remember your efforts to cripple your decadent nation. You shall not have died in vain. Or in your But... no! No! I wanted to save America, not destroy it! Oh, man! What have I done? Uh, excuse me. Sometimes it's kinder just to put them down. Develop a chemical that destroys human DNA. How 
would they even think of such a thing? Crypto, come and see me when you're ready. <laughs> 